Alright, hello guys. Today we're going to be talking about a severe weather outbreak that's possible for the 9th of March coming up. It's a day 5 uh, outlook from the from the National Weather Service. Uh, we're looking at a 15% chance, which is actually quite high for this far out. Usually when we see this, we know this is a sign that something serious could be coming. And now from what I've heard, uh, the southern portion of this... Uh, region looks to be the most uh, most have the most potential for a severe weather outbreak from Dallas through Louisiana and into Mississippi and Alabama uh, so anywhere south of Arkansas Oklahoma Tennessee the Missouri area doesn't have quite as high of a risk as of right now uh, but definitely the southern region has a really good chance of having uh, some severe weather happening now we are looking at our our map right here and you can see this is where the uh, again, the National Weather Service or Storm Prediction Center has put out their 15% their chance for day five. Again, Dallas, Monroe, uh, New Orleans, almost Houston, Memphis is in there, uh, Kansas City, also St. Louis is going to be there as well. So a lot of big name cities in here uh, for this severe weather risk, again, 9th of March. Now we're going to look at our GFS model real quick because our short range uh, mesoscale models don't go out far enough to forecast for this one. This is why it's kind of difficult and we're going to have to see what the future holds for this one because things could change uh, quite a bit here as our, as our normal severe weather models don't go out far enough to see. We do know there is a lot of potential according to the medium range models GFS. Right here you can see very heavy precipitation, those reds showing up. This, this really thinks there's going to be some some strong convection here. Uh, and I've, I've looked at the cape, and the cape looks pretty good as well. So a lot of potential here for some, some severe weather, definitely. Again, particularly, I think, Texas, Louisiana, Arkansas, Mississippi, and Alabama. Uh, we're going to also take a look at my March overall forecast. And you can see this little region that I put uh, severe weather potential uh, for the most severe weather potential. And you can see these areas have been getting severe weather already. Uh, we had some severe weather the other day in these areas uh, in Mississippi and Alabama and Georgia. Uh, but we're also going to see it possibly again on the 9th, of, the 9th of March. So it looks like this is coming into fruition uh, really, really, really early on, already looking really good. Anyway, guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. Stay up to date on the latest information from the uh, Storm Prediction Center. And also, I will continue to keep you guys updated on this storm over the coming days as the more short-range models like the NAM uh, are able to reach the range of these storms. Anyway, guys, I hope you have a great day, and I hope to see you in the next video as well.